Troy, story of the season, just left it too little too late? Yeah. Um, ultimately, mate, we, we've, we've not been good enough for the, the whole year. Um, and ultimately just give ourselves a little bit too much to do over the course of the year. Um, was it 12 games about before we got our first win? You know, there's 36 points left, um, you know, and we, and we ultimately needed three of them. So we know we haven't been good enough. There's no point making excuses, but it hasn't, hasn't been good enough. That's it. Just dwell on the game just a little bit. Three goals in 33 minutes here. You're giving yourself a mountain to climb on you. In any game, mate, yeah, whether that's Arsenal or, or Norwich, it doesn't matter. You can't keep going behind in games and expecting to win games. Um, and we've done that ever since we've come back from the, from the restart. I think that's eight in a row now where we've gone behind. Um, and I think it's just it's, it's the type of goals that are going in. I think as a, as a team, we're very disappointed. Um, and again, you know, we're not going to sit here and blame defenders. You know, as strikers, we, sh we could have scored three or four on, on another day. We had you know, some real good chances um, but ultimately you know we have to you have to see where we're at reassess it's a sad day for everyone involved but I think the, the, the bigger message is that you know the players come and go but the club will always be here um, we've been relegated before we've come back it's just another pick a mob let's go again try not to be miserable I know it's hard but you know as I say fans you know, I've, not, I've missed this. Haven't been able to come to games. People in real world have had COVID and all and all of the things associated that uh, with that with lockdown. And then ultimately, people at the place lose jobs over relegation. So we can't make it about players and we can't make it about individuals. It's all about the club and how we we move forward. Did you think you were in with a sniff of pulling off one of the great comebacks at one stage there? Because boy, did you throw the kitchen sink at them. Yeah, we did. We give we give it everything. But as I say on, on a. On a normal day, if you score two at the Emirates, you normally win. You can't afford to, you say, be three goals behind and, and the type of goals that we ultimately let in. Um, you know, they're a very good side, very good outfit. Um, but we also, say, left it just a little bit too much of a, of a, of a mountain to climb. You've been here 10 years, nearly. Mm -hmm. About two weeks away, I think. You love this place. How mm -hmm. much does this hurt? Of course it does. I'm not going to show it. Been a missus and the kids, unfortunately, they get it for the next two weeks, so I'm going to apologise in advance. But it's it's one of them situations where if I could take it all on myself, I would. I will do it on social media, you know how the game works, it is what it is, isn't it? But if I could do it all again, I would, but we can't. We've, uh, to say, 10 years, what, probably two weeks' time, 10 years? I was, I was here when we had three stands, 20 players, and you know seven of them were youth team products. So we've got to be realistic, understand where we're at, but ultimately we weren't good enough. We've got to be man enough to, to own it. As a club, as a community, we have to say from top to bottom, wasn't good enough. What more can we do? Let's say players will come and go, fans, people that work behind the scenes and the club will always be there. Can you paint a picture of the scene in the dressing room for us, Troy? Hmm. Um, gutted. There's no other way to say it. You know, some people have this is what people don't see. You look at Golmi, for example, it might be his last game in absolute tears because wasn't able to help, you know what I mean, and contribute in the way that obviously he would like to. But ultimately, as I say, players that, that how it feels right now don't matter. It's fans, it's, it's, it's the ladies that make the teats, the kit men, it's all them people that no one sees, the office staff. They're the people that are hurting now because they're looking around going, do we have a job or not? And ultimately, as players, we have to say, we have to take responsibility for that because we're the only people that can change that or could have changed that. So, as I say, I'm not going to talk about players. I'm not going to talk about myself. It's all about everybody else, really. And, and we hope that we can not be in the championship for too long. And, you know, as I say, if players are still here and some have moved on, so be it. But you guys will all be here and, and you're the guys that, you know, that this affects more than it does, you know, for me, for example, um, I know you know it affects me, but ultimately this is your livelihoods at the back of it, and all I can say is that, you know, I'm sorry. You won't want to make it about you, but I will. How is the knee? Yeah, it's not great. Operation uh, next week. Um, didn't ultimately want to throw it in and, and, you know, go. Could have easily done it, what was it, four weeks ago when I found out I had another injury. Could have easily went, ah, let me get my knee done sat around and you know it's not my fault I've missed so much of the season but it's, you know it's not my character 
some people will go, oh, you're rubbish anyway, whatever, it is what it is. But take the knee, clean it out, have a couple of days chilling with the, with the family and we, and we go again, mate. I'm not, okay. you know me, I'm not going to sit around and sulk. I'm going to think about it for today. I'm going to throw a few things, probably smash a few things, replace it <laughs> and, then, uh, and then go again, mate. I'm not, I say, I, all of us have had life experiences. This, this is football. It's a game. We love it. It's our job as well, but we love it. And we want, and we want to be in the biggest league in the world. That's ultimately what we want to do. Now, if that's with Watford, so be it. If that's not with Watford, so be it. But ultimately, it's about everybody else. Oi, you know what to do. Click the link over there, yeah?